Hi everyone, this is Dave and welcome to a new Mega Gadget Collection. I have got some amazing technology and gadgets to share with you today. And we're going to start with this power bank from Easy Accessories. So here we go. This is the power bank from EasyACC.com. Now, as with all of the products I show you in this video, I will leave a link to all of the manufacturers' websites and links to where you can buy these products in the video description. So this is a 20,000 milliamp hour battery pack. Why would you want one of these? Well, perhaps if you're going out and about traveling where you haven't got access to mains supply, uh, perhaps you're not staying in a hotel, perhaps you're going camping, something like this means you can charge your USB chargeable devices, things like smartphones, tablets, digital cameras, uh, portable gaming consoles, etc., via this device. And the 20,000 milliamp hour capacity means you could charge something like a smartphone from zero to 100%, probably around about eight times. Really very good indeed. Now it's primarily black. We've got this orange accent, one of my favorite colors, the main power on off button on the side. On this side here, we've got a couple of micro USB ports which you'd use to actually charge the battery inside here. And then we've also got four USB outputs, and these are smart USB ports. And what I mean by that is, is that you will plug a, a device in, be it a smartphone or a tablet, it will determine the correct ampage charge and give you the fastest possible charging time. We've also got a little flashlight here as well. Now if we push the button on the side, you'll see we've got some LED indicators. This shows you how much charge you've got left inside the battery pack. Each one represents about 25%. If we double tap, the flashlight comes on. So if you're using this whilst you're camping, you've got a built-in flashlight. Double tap again, turns that flashlight off. And then a long press on the power button turns the power bank off to conserve energy. This is a really useful device. I always recommend you have at least one power bank in your collection of tech because they're just really useful. You don't know when you're going to run out of power and when you're going to need to charge a device. Next up, we've got another product from easyacc.com. This is their USB charging dock. Now it comes supplied with a power cable that you plug into the back, and it also comes supplied with this, a micro USB to full size USB cable. You can use this to dock your smartphone or tablet and charge it. Now the idea is that you'd use these smart USB ports on the back which auto detect the optimal ampage output to charge your device really quickly and you plug the USB cable into the back and then into the side of your device. Now I use an iPhone, it doesn't come with a lightning cable so I'm going to use my own. This does not come supplied with this particular product just to make that clear. And the idea is you'd have your cable like so. I'm going to get my iPhone 6s plus you need to put it in this position here in the horizontal position and then you plug your charging cable into the side so it just offers up a nice neat solution to actually charge your devices on a dock it's going to make it stand up so if you're using this on a bedside table ideal for viewing back videos whilst you're charging and i just think it's a, a really nice device i think it's a uh, a nice solution to charge possibly two devices at the same time, although you can only dock one at a time in the dock itself. This is the Easy ACC USB charging dock. Woof, woof, this is the Wonder Woof. A really nice looking little peppermint green box. Now I'm going to admit a tech failure in this video. Not the product's fault, but a problem I had testing this device. Now let's just take this off. We just peel this off the side, I think. I had this open earlier. There we go, we'll peel the ribbon off. This is a activity tracker for your dog. How cute is this? Let me just take this out completely so you can see it. And I thought the idea of this was absolutely fantastic. So it's a little bow tie or bone, and this simply clips on to your dog's collar and then it tracks their activity, and through the app, you can then see how active your pet has been. There's also a little cover here with a micro USB charging port and a little LED light on the side as well. Now, the reason that I am revealing this as a tech failure on my part, not on the product's part, is that every time I put this on my little Shih Tzu Milo, he went absolutely crazy. 
Even when I left it on him for a few hours, he just would not settle down having this attached to his collar. So it was really distressing to him. Other dogs, and I've only got one dog, but other dogs, it might be absolutely fine. They might forget they've got it on their collar and settle down with it. I would worry about them getting it off and chewing it, but it is a nice, innovative way, if you can get your dog to accept this, being dangling around its neck, of actually tracking your pet's activity. I see it's got some potential, but it just wasn't for Milo. This is the Wonderwoof activity tracker for your pet. Next up, I've got a really gorgeous leather snap-on case for your iPhone 6 Plus or iPhone 6S Plus. Indeed, it's available for other sizes as well. This is from a company called Nomo. I've featured their brand on the channel before. I can't sing the praises enough about the quality of Nomo products. And this one is no exception. We've got a nice rubberized finish around the sides to give you some shock protection, cutouts for all of your ports and controls, so everything's easily accessible. A nice cutout for the camera as well. And the highlight is inset in this plastic snap-on case is this leather panel, and this is really nice quality leather, nice and tactile, it's got no chemical smell to it, and it just adds an, an edge of quality to the case. We've got the Nomo London uh, embossing in the bottom here as well. I just absolutely love it, it's very comfortable to hold. This is the Nomo leather snap-on case. This is the Noak. It's a Bluetooth padlock, and if you took that technology out of it, I would still love it. It's such a tactile device, very nicely designed, very heavy duty as well. We've got a brushed metal casing, and then we've also got a polished silver sort of barrel locking mechanism here. The Noak branding, of course, across the front, and a little LED light here as well. But as I mentioned, this has got Bluetooth technology in it, and I wanna show you the application. You can see here, I've got my lock already registered to my account. I can also move across and actually add in extra users. I can add fobs as well. I can look at a log of when my lock was locked and unlocked, and I've also got a general settings tab as well. If I go back across here and click on the lock, I can actually share with a new user so they can unlock it as well, and I can set up a two-step unlock as well. Now, the reason you'd want to share it with another user is so that they can add it to their smartphone. When the smartphone is in the vicinity of the lock, you can simply push down and it will unlock. If the smartphone is out of range, so I'm gonna move my smartphone to the other side of my studio. So this should now be out of range of the lock. Come back over to the camera here and try to unlock and it will not unlock. So let's walk again, I'm gonna move across and pick my smartphone up again and run back to the camera. And you can see here, as I approached it, it has actually unlocked. How cool is that? We've also got an unlock button that appears on the display as well. Now let's assume that you haven't got a smartphone with you. Well, you can still unlock the Noak. Now, at the moment, when I try to unlock it, it won't unlock, but you can set up a series of presses on here and if you get the combination correct, it will still unlock the padlock. How cool is that? Very, very cool indeed. This is the Noak Bluetooth padlock. I think it's certainly something that I would consider adding to the security in my home. And I just think it brings tech into something so simple and it works extremely well. So the final piece of technology in this Mega Gadget collection is in fact two products from Elgato. Now, the one on the left here is the Elgato Eve Weather, and this is for outdoor use, and it monitors temperature, humidity, and air pressure. Both of the products, and in fact, all of the Eve range work with Apple HomeKit, and I'll show you the app in a short while. The second one is the Elgato Eve Room, and this one is for indoor use, and it measures air quality, temperature, and humidity. Now, this is what they look like. Very, very compact units, just little white boxes really, that you're gonna place in a suitable position. Uh, we've also got some sort of vents in the side here so that it can obviously do its uh, monitoring and measuring of the various things, such as temperature, humidity, and air pressure. 
This one is the Eve Room. Same box, exactly the same design, and you're gonna place this in a suitable position, connect it up to the app, and I've got the app running here, and inside the app, you've got the main sort of settings control. This is where you can set up rooms, uh, name the rooms, change the appearance of the app. Uh, also, you can have guest access, set up scenes and zones, just plenty of configurability in the application. And then you get rooms and different types of measurements. Now, if you had more than one of these connected, like the outdoor one and the indoor one, then if you tapped on something like temperature, it would show you the outdoor and indoor temperature. At the moment, I've only got it paired with the Eve room and it's showing it's 22.7 degrees in the studio. We've also got humidity, which is at 67%. We tap again, it gives us a little graph so we can see how things have changed over time. It does the same for temperature as well. In fact, all of the measurements, you can get graphs up. Now, with regards to air quality, it is excellent at the moment, 450 ppm. So that's really good, very, very uh, good to see that reading. And this was looking at the individual types of measurement. If you tap on the actual room, then you get them all listed in this really nice interface. So here, of course, you can see the air quality is excellent, 22.8 degrees centigrade, it just changed, and 67% humidity. A really well laid out application with some very useful information. And the fact that you can connect this to multiple different devices in the range really is good. I absolutely love it. I'm gonna add these certainly to my home and my garden. This is the Elgato Eve. So that's it for this Mega Gadget collection. Thank you very much for watching. Please do check out all of the links in the video description. There's links to every single product, including these two, in the video description. Please do give this video a like, I really do appreciate it. Subscribe to the channel and I'll see you all in another video very soon.